subscriptions all your comments i really do appreciate it and if you are new to my channel hey girl hey boy how y'all doing welcome to my page now i was debating whether to do a hair tutorial or aliexpress haul but i'm dumb excited for all of these items that i received received like they sent it to me that i bought with my own coins but if you are interested in this hair if you are a big curly hair lover like myself you enjoy the lion mane and all that jazz then please comment below all of the details that you want to know about this hair and i'll be sure to include them all in my next aliexpress hair tutorial video but back to the aliexpress haul if you're like me and this is the first time that you're hearing that aliexpress has clothing anything other than hair then yes sis we have been sleep we have been slumped. So yes, AliExpress has more than hair. They have clothing. They have accessories. They have makeup. They low-key have it all. We've been asleep, but now we are woke. We are woke. So if you are excited about this video, then keep watching. The first thing that I will be showing you guys is the accessories that I got from AliExpress. So um, the first pair of shades that I got from AliExpress were these bad boys. These were the classical aviator sunglasses, night vision, goggles, yellow lens, men's. I didn't know they were men's sunglasses, but oh well. And these joints were only for $2.99. Now, as a disclaimer, I'm not sure if maybe it was just me, but I was not hip. Like, I knew they were colored shades, but I wasn't ready for the different contrast of vision I was about to look out of. Literally, everything is yellow as I speak. So, me and my sister had tried on um, some red shades, and I don't know how you guys do it, but everything was red, everything was on fire, I was having a panic attack, I couldn't look, I couldn't breathe, I couldn't do it. So, yellow, I think, is more of a subtle color. I can handle this, I can handle this right now. The next pair of shades I got were these reflective sunglasses 2016 new oversized women flat top sunglasses but these specific shades were 764 and i will say this when comparing aliexpress um items to each other this could be seen as more of the pricier sunglasses but let's be real if you were to buy these from 21 forever 21 different places then you're not going to get these for 765 you could probably find these for um no less than 10 15 20 dollars so the next pair of shades i love these like look at them i don't know exactly what shape but it's not a square and it's not a circle either um I don't know, but I'm down with whatever shape it is. These were the new over 2017 new oversized rimless sunglasses, clear, um, unique shades, and these ran for five ninety six. What? Five dollars and ninety six cents. These are just cute, super cute, and super fashionable and affordable. The last pair of sunglasses that I bought from AliExpress were these. I've seen these sunglasses on a lot of people and men specifically they just have it in clear but i ordered these um in black you know just trying to step outside of the box please so. hurry up oh, oh. hold on dude yeah <laughs> these are the gothic steampunk sunglasses men women um wrap eyeglasses around blah 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 these were only five <laughs> so yes these are so cute if you just want to get in some more sunglasses and if you're like me, I buy a lot of sunglasses and I don't even wear them, but I will wear them. The last accessory that I purchased from AliExpress was this. Okay. This is a clear clutch and um, it um, came just like this. It was actually packaged very, very well. I 
forgot what I had ordered when I ordered all these things. I didn't know if I'd order a bomb on accident, but this was wrapped to the max. I'm talking boxes on top of boxes on top of boxes on top of packaging and styrofoam. I was like, what did I order? And it was just this, but I appreciate it. This little clear clutch, it comes just like these. And of course, you know, AliExpress is always throwing in random stuff. When you order hair, they're always throwing in some scrunches or throwing in some lashes that they should be on Barbies. They literally just throw in anything. They threw in the cutie. Ooh, I'm a... I don't know what this is. I really don't know what this is. I can't tell you, though. I don't know. But I appreciate it. It's the Pongui. Classic acrylic, uh, Pongwe Classic Acrylic Women's Clutch Evening Bag. And this ran for $16.80. Me thinking that it was an actual purse, $16.80, I was here for it. But it being a clutch, I think if I would have known that it was a clutch prior to it, I probably wouldn't have ordered it. But I'm not returning it, so here I am. It's cute though. I would definitely recommend it if you're into clutches and things such as that. Now the next thing that I would get into is the makeup. I was really skeptical and I didn't want to get too ahead of myself with ordering makeup, so I just started with lashes. These are the Dare Princess 3-Piece um, Mink Eyelashes. And um, I saw these and if you're like me, I wear lots of eyelashes all the time. And they can be super expensive, especially the mink eyelashes that everybody's going for. So we can't always afford them. These eyelashes were only two sets and I got two packs of these. I'm still wearing the other three from the other pack. I just wanted to put on a fresh pair for this YouTube video. These eyelashes are bomb. 276 for three pairs. What? I'll buy one pair for $5 if it's Ardell or if it's um, Kiss. So I will definitely be ordering these mugs in bulk. So knowing me, I would wait until I got sick to do my very first voiceover, but it's whatever. Um, here is my first piece of clothing that I got from AliExpress. It is just a regular crop top that says Vogue on the front. Um, I saw this and I thought it was really cheap, so why not add a little pizzazz to my closet? Um, please excuse me, Rake It Up is definitely on, so that's why I'm acting a fool. But, um, as I said, um, this one was really cheap. It was only $4.99. So, here I am getting into my chicken head. If you know me, you know I take this very, very seriously. Okay, so the second piece of clothing that I got from AliExpress was this high-waisted skirt. I have been wanting some overalls for the longest, but I was not able to find one this summer. So I found this skirt, and I said, why not? So it was... <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I told y'all I was sick. But um, the overalls was only $22.76. It was kind of expensive, but I was the first day of school. I got so many compliments. And um, there's a slit in the back if you don't like slits in the back. But here I am, flavorfully showing you the back. Cheetah Girls is on. I'm sorry, but yeah. So I know summer has pretty much come to an end, but hey, it is summer somewhere, okay? So this Kente swimsuit, I really wanted to do some type of um, African photo shoot in the summer. And I didn't have time to make the swimsuit, so I decided to look for one. And thank God, AliExpress had one. Y'all, the set was only $9.61. It fit perfectly. I got so many compliments. Again, excuse me, my song was on. But yeah, this was just perfect. So this was the last piece of clothing that I ordered from AliExpress. Um, I had saw this two-piece set on Instagram, on Twitter, and I said I had to find it. So I looked on AliExpress, and they had it on there for only $9.61. Now, this is a disclaimer. To be honest, I feel like whoever made this outfit used Elmer's glue, had some shade glitter, glued it, and then sent it to me. Because literally, glitter is falling everywhere. I personally do not recommend this if you want to wear this frequently. This is re really just a take a picture and put this away. But if you like it for things like that, then uh, maybe this piece is for you, but not for me. Excuse my behavior. So you guys, that concludes my very first AliExpress haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions, all the links to everything that I bought, I'll post down below. If you want to see 
more videos as I said different haul videos different hair videos then please comment below oh one other thing that I wanted to start doing in my YouTube videos was putting other people on so I'm always down other youtubers know the struggle of having to find music that's not copyrighted or having to only use a short amount of the song to use it in your videos so if you make music um, whether you rap, you sing, you do all of that, if it's good quality music, then please comment your links below and I will play, depending on what type of music it is or depending on what type of vibe it's giving me, then I'll be sure to start playing those during my YouTube videos. So one, we don't gotta worry about copyrights and two, when I get on, you get on. Again, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing and liking. I can see you guys again. Bye.